Good morning. We've got to make some space because new barn things are beginning to arrive. getting a few things, a little bit of lumber for one, uh, and basically what they're talking about is having, you know, depending on the company we're dealing with, having things kind of trickle in over the next several months based on one, when it's ordered and delivered, and two, when we might actually need it. Today's, coming from Dairy Lane, is going to be mats, the mats that are going to go under all the heifer stalls. So they're things that basically, you know, don't, don't need to be in where it's warm or anything. So we don't need to take up room in the shop, but do probably want to be out of the weather. So we're going to tuck in here beside the plywood. Let's get them unloaded. Well, the hay's in great shape, don't get me wrong. My design of it might not be in as good a shape. But that's mom's problem now. She's the one that's going to drive the square baler and pick it all up. Her problem now. All right, time to head back to the Yates family homestead. Get the little square baler fired up for the first time for the year. Mom's driving, all oh, load. They got lots of help though, so may even have have some help loading, which always makes the afternoon pretty easy. 
And yeah, we'll get those two fields we flipped yesterday. We'll get them hopefully baled up without any issues, knock on wood. And they'll have all the hay they need for the year for the sheep. maybe not quite as shiny as I was when it first arrived. Little dirt already there. But that's okay. Grandpa was working with it a little while. And he got along really good with it. So we are going to work at tidying up one of the pastures. this pasture we're gonna do the dry cow pasture because on the heifer side they'll work away at the grass is still fairly long there but especially when things dry up they'll be able to trim that down quite a bit the close-up cows the dry cows they'll never keep up with it so we're just gonna keep it tidy stock choppers on now so I might as well be in here trying to get a bit of this bush tidied up maybe well anyway it's been a bit busy couple of days don't worry we have a long long list this time of year so lots to do we'll see you next week <laughs>